You know, there are some things that I just thank the Lord. By default, I never got to go maybe to the internet and Google or uh, ask someone to explain to me what they really mean. But by default, they begin to make sense. I think for also for years, I have heard of the term soulmate, soulmate, soulmate. And I believe I would entertain the word soulmate, soulmate. But finally, when I began to real to understand what soulmate meant, really, I was like, I guess I was wrong. I never understood what soulmate meant. And by then, it's like it was just dropped into me. By the spirit of the Lord. It was just dropped and soulmate meant. And even to this very day, I have not gone to the internet. I won't lie to you. But I will go. But let me tell you now. I will only go to confirm. But right now, I think I don't need. Okay? Because when it comes to soulmate, you must understand. I'm not talking about soulmate, of course. But I want you to understand that this person right now, they don't love you. They seem like everything is okay. But that does not mean that... uh. They are sick. And when I say sick with this time, I'm trying to say that there are some people who you want to pray over that God made them realize we are meant to be. Oh, Lord, there is something wrong with. No, 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 no. Stop doubting. There are some people that you just won't connect. I remember some years. I remember some friends who will try to hook me up. Back then, I remember this friend of mine, she saw this other Christian, God-fearing lady. And she was like, oh, you guys can be good together. But when we got together, we realized nothing we are similar but we could not vibe you know what i'm saying so listen you must understand that when you are meant to be together it oh my god everything you will just click you'll just fit each other like a glove that is a good sign that you can look upon i'm not talking about forcing things but i'm just ta i'm talking about automatically you click Jacob just loved Rachel. They, it just made sense. Oh my God. They, the Bible says Sarah respected or submitted to Abraham to an extent where she referred to him as master. You don't have to, to go according to the standards of the world where they say, no, you are all equal 50-50. A woman that respects you as a man, by default, she won't have to say, uh, we are equal. She will just enjoy even submitting to you by default. She won't even care how it looks, whether some people, they say, ah, he's trying to. No, you won't even argue that you respect me as a man. It will happen by default. And that man will just love you like that. He won't. Oh, my God. I pray for you right now. Let it be so. Let the spirit of the Lord guide you in Jesus mighty name. Amen. And of course, that's all I had. My details on the comment section below. See you next time.